Okay then guys, so we've got an interesting one today, one that I didn't think I'd be covering, but it's been around for a couple of days now, and this news is a little bit crazy, because players are now being banned. Yeah, I know, we're going to jump straight into it right now, but before we do, if you'd be so kind to smash the beautiful blue thumbs up and subscribe with post notifications turned on, it'd be greatly appreciated. We've also just launched our mental range merch that you will find down in the description. All of this helps me out a absolute ton, so feel free to check it out. Anywho, let's crack on with the video. Now there does seem to be an item of armor in this game that is getting players soft banned, and that's literally just by picking these up if dropped by other players. Now you can't actually obtain this armor set whatsoever in the game unless you hack into it. Now you can't hack into it and cheat in this game without bypassing the Elden Ring anti-cheat system, and that is simply just owning the pants that is going to actually cause you a soft ban. Now as this has previously been reported, players have discovered that a cut pair of underwear in the game called the Deathbed Smalls was meant to be a part of the NPC Fiona's armor set. Although unobtainable in the game right now, they have been in the game files now for a little while. Now what happens if you actually have this? According to a couple of Reddit users actually owning these items, they have managed to get them in unnatural ways. Therefore actually being these third party websites that you guys can purchase runes or armor sets, weapons, all of that good stuff, you can actually buy those from websites. And people have been purchasing this armor piece because it's not been seen in game yet. And by just owning these armor armor pieces, it is giving you a soft ban and blocking players from being online inside of Elden Ring. Now this is a massive, massive issue and something which is going to be a cause and effect sort of thing. They have also been apparently contacting Bandai Namco and submitting tickets to request the ban to be reversed. Now the response that people have actually received is that they would like to inform them to remove any modified data and characters in their PC unit to avoid this from reoccurring as the next possible suspension may be permanent. So just owning this armor set may actually cause for a full time Elden Ring ban. Now what people are also finding out is that just deleting this item alone is not going to save you in side of this. You have to physically delete the save file of which this was owned. Now this is a very weird item to say the least and one I'm not too sure why you'd want to own. Now what seems worse is that actually is general players that are just invading people's games and dropping these items so you as an unsuspected player will pick them up and the soft ban gets kicked in. It's absolutely mental to know that this is a thing although in the most recent patch of 1.04 apparently and supposedly this has been removed, although which has allowed unauthorized items to be passed to other players. So it does seem that the issue may have been fixed. Now there are people that have been contacting Bandai Namco to try and get some more information with regards to this, although we don't have anything in solid writing just yet. It is really, really interesting to know that a piece of armor can actually suspend your account and take you offline for good and potentially even eradicate you from the game altogether. This is but a big issue for a small thing. So if you happen to get the piece of armor that's on screen right now, please do not pick it up. This is definitely not worth you not being able to play the game again. This is definitely not worth you being able to not play online again. So this is just not worth it as an overall as the armor piece itself is relatively irrelevant. You may find the novelty in it for the first 30 seconds, but after that point, are you genuinely going to go to the Elden Beast and start taking it out whilst wearing this? Most definitely not. So don't take the risk and don't pick up an item that is named this. Just make sure you stay in self safe out there guys it does not seem to be worth the risk as an overall now that's all we've got for today and hopefully this has been patched out hopefully people do not have the access to be able to get hold of this anymore although it is still on websites from what i have seen as of today which is the 21st of april 2022 people are still being able to buy it on third party websites so i don't know if this patch has actually been put into place properly as i don't feel like testing it out myself and taking the risk of a soft ban Anywho, that's all we've got time for today. Thanks again for watching, guys. I appreciate all of your damn faces. If you haven't already, smash the like button and subscribe if post notification is turned on. And like I said originally, check out our new merch store, which is the Mental Range. It helps me out greatly. Every piece definitely helps me go into full time a little bit further. Thanks again for watching. Appreciate all your faces. And as always, up until the next time, I'll see you in the clouds.